Today I am going over the Tesla System Update 2021.44.6 that I am downloading right now. Let's see what we get. As of the recording of this video on December 20th, there are about 2.2% of the Model 3 owners with this update. So this will be the newest available at this time. Watch out for 2021.44.25 that is coming soon. It looks like a big update with a whopping 14 changes. Going to the software screen, click on the release notes to get some more information on this update. 2021.44.6 includes one update, minor fixes. Looking at the detail doesn't give us much to go on, so I'm guessing it's the usual bug fixes and stability improvements. I never got 2021.44.5, so I'll cover that in this video. We have two updates. Driver door unlock mode. This is a safety improvement that, when selected, allows only the driver's door to unlock when pressing unlock on the app key fob or key card. Let's go into the menu to see. Click on the main menu button on the lower left screen. Then go to the locks screen. Scroll down and you will see a new option right here. Driver door unlock mode. Toggle this button if you want to use it. Let's test it out real quick. First using the phone app, press the front door and it opens. Then press the back door and it stays locked just as it's supposed to do with this update. I'm going to do it again. This time I'm going to try to open the rear door first. And yes, it does open. So I'm guessing whichever door you try to open first will open when you press unlock. I turned off my phone's Bluetooth so it wouldn't affect the results. So next I'm going to use the key fob. Holding the key fob, and then I press the front door handle, and yes, it opens. Then I press the back door, and it stays locked. And this time with the car locked again, I'll try to open the rear door first. And yes, it does open. And lastly, using the key card. Press the key card against the B pillar, and the car unlocks. Now press the front door handle, and yes, it opens. While doing the same on the rear door, it stays locked. And with the car locked again, I put the key card against the B pillar and then try the rear door. However, it doesn't open, unlike the phone app and the key fob. That's interesting. Going back to the release notes, we have the next update, driver profiles. This allows each driver profile to have its own individual work and home addresses, which is handy if you have multiple people using the car. Go to the navigation and then press and hold the home button. Then you can change the address for this particular driver profile. And now do the same thing for work and then switch to a different driver profile, and then you can change those work and home addresses as well. And that's it for system update 2021.44.6. Not a whole lot, but some people will like the door unlock settings for the safety aspect. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.